On 9-11, people said, here's our opportunity to help. Even though we knew nobody by name, we did, they were all strangers when they came to Gander. How the community came together, it, it was an amazing feat. In the moments after the September 11th terrorist attacks, United States airspace was closed. Hundreds of inbound flights needed a safe place to land. One of those places was Gander, Newfoundland. Once you get halfway across the ocean, the closest airport is Gander. And at that day, they were told to land at the nearest airport. And 38 aircraft was nearer to Gander than they were any other airport. I get this call get up in back of the airport. So I go up there, and I'm just in awe. I watch this big jet come in, and I look again, and there's lights of another one. I go, oh, God. The night the planes landed here, I was at the Legion, and the first thing come out of my mouth was, thank God they're coming here, because I know they're going to be looked after. Not saying they wouldn't be looked after elsewhere, but I knew they would be looked after here. Nearly 7,000 shaken and disoriented passengers arrived in Gander, almost doubling the population of the tiny Canadian town. A plan of action went into place just like that, and that's what the whole community became involved in. I don't know of anybody who, who didn't do something, be it you know, something big or something small. Everybody seemed to have uh, done something because you knew it had to be done. All across Gander, people opened their doors to stranded passengers, including over 700 at a local primary school. The teachers went home that day and emptied out their linen closet, took every blanket and pillow that was not on the bed, and they brought it back to the school. By the early morning, maybe five or six o'clock, we had had four flights arrive at Gander Academy. We kind of went on adrenaline. I know I didn't go home and sleep until 72 hours later. It just went on for days, and everything that we needed seemed to come and I still don't know how that happened. This is one from a school teacher in Montclair, New Jersey. He sent me that on the first anniversary. People invited them into their homes, gave them keys to their cars, the keys to their home, and never blinked twice about it. The generosity of the people of Gander was a bright spot on one of the world's darkest days. When it was all over, I was never more prouder that the greatest strength we have is our people, and we have great people here in Gander. <laughs>